I'm gonna do uh, fried meat wings. So once again, I use I like to mash up the garlic one and a half for about ten to twelve meat wings. And after the garlic, I'm gonna add in. You can just put in salt and pepper. That will be good enough. But I'm gonna add in. Go. I'm gonna add in um, salt. I'm gonna add in just a little bit of salt. Not so much, about half a teaspoon. A little bit of fish sauce. And then pepper. And half a teaspoon of turmeric. Mix it well, season it for at least 15 20 minutes. And then one teaspoon of cornstarch. That's it. Just soak the blue pea shoot flour with hot water until the color comes out. I'm going to do a pork version of an ota. So just about 300 grams of minced pork. Put in about half a tablespoon of sugar. And then I want to beef up. I'm going to add in some onions. Uh, carrots, sorry. Add in a minced onion, about half a large minced onion, and uh, we're gonna add in two tablespoons of the red Thai chili curry paste. This is already very uh, salty, so you don't want to put too much inside. Okay. Uh, just a pinch of salt inside a little bit you don't want to be too salty and then uh, we're gonna have two tablespoon of cornstarch to help the bind you can add eggs if you want to but I put two tablespoons and you put about you put coconut cream about four tablespoons of coconut cream One, two, three, and just blend it all together. You should be able to have a great paste. Mix it all together. You don't need to put carrots, but I like some colors and veggies inside. Into a long paste. And then uh, cover it. Which is all covered together. And then just poke it in with my sati stick. It's long, but doesn't matter. Go. One more slice. So keep it long because it's kind of thin. So you keep it long. Alright. Pull it. Pull it. In, secure it. Oops. Put it in the skin. 
Hover. Hover. Use the stick. Secure it. Oopsie. Press it down, put it here, just to press it. Oven, let's try for about 180 for 20 minutes. The rice with pandan leaves and then blue pea shoot water and we're gonna add in coconut milk We've diluted with water and a little bit of salt to go into the rice and just boil it. Pouring about two tablespoons of rice starch to taste to give a finer coating and it will become very crispy when you fry it. Let it stick to the skin so that when you fry it, it will not drop much of the powder and then your oil will not be so dirty. See, make it very lumpy everywhere and it will be very nice. Don't touch it when even though it's sticking, after it's hot, it will release on its own. Two 
little bit of this cucumber and then an egg French beans. One old town. There you go. Here's a simple nasi lemak lunch at home. Homemade ota, fried chicken wing, French beans, egg, voila. Here's a homemade nasi lemak, blue pea coconut rice. Something simple for tonight. Here's my simple lunch with blue pea coconut pandan rice, turmeric garlic chicken wings, crispy anchovies, French beans, homemade pork, and carrot ota. Bon appetit! This my Blue pea coconut rice with a little bit of ikan bilis and sambal. Bon appetit. Want some?